Now, question five by first principles is pretty darn messy. It makes a bit of sense in this instance to make use of our graphics calculator. So in order to do that, I'm going to use the um, action. I could use interactive transformation, and I'm going to expand. Now, I'm going to expand uh, five lots of x plus, now to find the h, bring up a keyboard, alpha will do the job there. Now I'll close that and I'm going to take from that the 5x minus 3x to the power of 4. So when I do that, I end up with the 3h to the power of 4 plus 12h x cubed plus 12 h cubed x plus 18 h squared. I'll just move that along a little. h squared x squared plus 5h all over h. Dividing that through, I get 3h cubed plus 12 x to the power of 3 plus 12 h squared x plus 8 um, h squared x plus 5h. Now, as h approaches 0, I lose everything with an h. Oh, that should be 5, sorry. Lose everything that still has an h in it. So 12x cubed plus 5 will be the order of the day. So to take the derivative of 5x plus 3x to the power of 4, 12x cubed plus 5. Now, in this subject, we do encourage you to do few things, quite a few things by pen and paper, but equally there will be cases where clearly, and this is one of these cases, where your graphics calculator comes in very handy indeed.